trucks. Welcome back, everybody. Taking a quick look at our current conditions. We have 65 degrees in San Angelo, 84% humidity. Winds are fairly calm at this time. Looking around the rest of the region, we do have mid-60s for current temperatures across the board here. And humidity levels are going to be a little bit higher, mostly in the 80s around the region. A little bit more dry off to Big Lake in Arizona, and I say dry in the 70s, and then 90s for junction. So with the calm winds and the higher humidities, we can expect a little more condensation and dew that might be on our cars and the grass this morning. So we do have some clouds pushing through most of the Contra Valley region. Very light shower to the southwest around Crockett County. Zooming out to the state satellite radar, not a whole lot going on. We just have some scattered showers off to the south. However, most of the main talk right now is Hurricane Sally upgraded to a Category 1. Expected to upgrade possibly to a Category 3 as it makes landfall later this week. But then after, it's going to push off to the Atlantic once again. We also have Hurricane Paulette that's still sitting in the Atlantic. It's hitting Bermuda at this time as a Category 2 hurricane. And at the same time, we also have Vicky and Teddy that are both tropical storms. We only have one letter left in the alphabet for hurricanes this year, and that's W, which is Wilfred. And then we're heading into the Greek alphabet, which has not happened since 2005. So for today, we are going to be having partly cloudy skies to start off, and then we'll have a bit more clouds coming through early afternoon. Winds are also going to start picking up from the northeast about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Highs are expected to be in the low to mid 80s across the region. So about the same as what we had yesterday. Now we will see those clouds pushing off later on today. And then we'll have mostly sunny skies for tomorrow. Some lingering showers off on the very eastern edge heading into Thursday. We'll have a mix of sun and clouds once again. Tonight we are dropping to 64 degrees for a low with mostly clear skies. Tomorrow we can expect 86 for a high, mostly sunny skies. Breaking on the seven-day forecast for the rest of the week, we will have chances of showers Thursday and Friday, and then plenty of sunshine with mid-80s for highs for the weekend.